What would you feel if you were a girl brought up by your family only to be sold to a man when you reached a specific age? How would you feel if your sole responsibility was to bring money to your family by being sold for the highest bid possible? Every year, young girls are gathered together in a festival where they will be sold to the highest bidder. That's true. It sounds straight out of a scenery from a history lesson. But, and oh, this is happening till this date in Bulgaria. Welcome to today's video, in which we will discuss the heated topic of the Bulgarian bride market. This practice, in which young women are bought and sold to be married, has been the focus of discussion for many years. Human trafficking is one of the worst cases in society. Yes, modern society does not accept human trafficking at all. In fact, it is illegal to do so in many countries. But, despite how much it is frowned upon still, there is human trafficking going on under the table in the black markets. This practice is unethical and illegal in many countries. Yet there are few countries in the world where it is still happening as a tradition. One such country is Bulgaria. The Kalaidzi community of Bulgaria, to be specific. In this community, bride markets are socially accepted. And almost all people in the Kalaidzi community buy their partners from the bride market, which is held annually. Mostly bride markets refer to when young women list themselves up for the bidding. So that men from developed and prosperous countries can pick and purchase them in the notion of getting married. However, this strategy was majorly exploited by the men who purchased the women. This happens when a girl gets picked up without the intention of marrying and being used for prostitution and sexual abuse. Well, the Kalaidzi Bride Market is a kind of festival in Bulgaria. In the past, it is said that the parents chose and sold their daughters to the highest bidder. But now it seems that the girls to be sold have a small say in who they want to marry. Contrary to the original idea of bride markets, in Bulgaria, they marry the girls they buy. Actually, the sad answer is no. The Kalaidzi community is a poor community in Bulgaria. They makes their living out of selling handmade copperware. But since the market for copperware is dropping drastically, they need sources of extra income to live. So selling their daughters at the bride market brings them an income of about $7,000 which is roughly the amount a person earns in a year. Still, some girls have relationships before marriage which are often hidden and then broken before. The girl's virginity is a must. If a girl at the market has lost their virginity before, she is considered to be a prostitute, a whore by the community. Virginity is a key factor that confirms the parents' higher prices in the market. Then, there is the beauty of the girls. The more beautiful the girl is, the higher the price of the girl. When considering beauty, the parents of the boys tend to like fair, blue-eyed girls more than tan or black-eyed girls. In the Kalaidzi community, the girls who are sold in the bride market vary from ages 14 to 20. This age is considered to be the marital age in their society. However, on rare occasions, one could find a girl who surpassed that age. The normal price of a girl is around $7,000. But this can skyrocket if you want to buy and marry a beautiful young girl. It is said that beautiful girls hover over the $20,000 price point, which is a fortune for the girl's parents. Sadly, Kaladian girls do not complete their secondary education. This is because the parents are scared that they might try to leave the tradition behind when a girl becomes educated. That will indeed become a huge drop in the family's income. Also, most girls are not even allowed to meet men outside their families. 
They are not even allowed to attend social events unless they are chaperoned for fear of being contacted by men. Kalatsian girls are often not allowed to marry outside their community. So it is unlikely that a foreigner will get a chance to find a girl at the bridal market. Although the name bride market suggests girls being sold off as inanimate objects, it actually is not the case. A person might view this as some kind of dowry common in most cultures. One might debate that it is forced on the girl. It might be true, but still, even in other cultures and even the most modern cultures, there are cases of forced marriages, which should be addressed globally.